This weekend at Arcana, buyers will lay their eyes on First Crop Foals by Recorder, the Queen's Group 3 winning son of Galileo. We visited the horse at Montfort et Preau and spoke with Mathieu Alex about him. As you know, he's owned by Her Majesty the Queen of England, which was um, very important. We all know how good you know, she has done for this industry and she loves this horse, she's bred him, he has raced for her. It was a big deal for us to get this phone call and we obviously were interested, loved his pedigree, loved his racing records and we were um, very excited about having him here. Ricardo was one of the highest um, rated two-year-old in England that year. He, he won his maiden very impressively, defeating a group one winner. And then he was an impressive winner of the Acom Stakes. The horse was third that the Simric was subsequently better, um, just little than a, sh a short head in a, in a Group 1 Prix Jean-Luc Lagardère in France, so he had true Group 1 form. Unfortunately, he only raced at two, but uh, he showed that he had a lot of ability. Ricardo is, is, is obviously very, very well bred. He's, he's by one of the best sire in the world in Galileo, and, and his mother, Memory, by the Lancer, um, was again a very talented two-year-old. She won in Ascot and she's also won in, in Newmarket as a two-year-old. Um, you know, being a Group 3 and a Group 2 winner at two is, is a big thing. She was a fast filly. Um, and Ricardo was also a, a fast son of Galileo, which was, uh, you know, it, it's, a, it's a very important thing for us here in France. So he has a great chance. We supported him with some of our best mares here. Um, the likes of La Huguette, you know, she was a first La Havre stakes winner and she was placed, she was third in the Prix Jean Pratt. She was a very good Group 1 and she's produced a fantastic call by him. So we, we have supported him the same way as we did with La Havre, and we will keep doing so, um, but also from, from outside breeders and also English, uh, breeders from England. So he, he had a great support. They look forward, they, they look like they'll be sharp to year old. So, you know, time will tell, but we're excited about him. Our Majesty has sent 10 mares to the, to the stallion and to recorder every year, which is fantastic support. You know, again, it's, it, it's great to, 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 to work it as, as a team. We're, we're very thankful of that. It, it's, a, it's a great partnership. The recorder's falls are, are very easy to deal with. Um, we have about 20 on the farm, so we have a good, um, uh, a good knowledge of, of what they are physically and, and also mentally. They seem to have a lot of confidence, which is great. And we, we really like them physically, they're, they're, they're strong and they're very forward. They're the type of foals that are born and you know, as soon as they can get up, they come to you and see you, and which is great. Ricardo stems his foals and, and what we like is that there's a lot of Galileo about them, a lot of quality. Um, they have the nice, nice heads and, and move well. Um, I think the breeders were, they liked him obviously, but also they, they really appreciate that Her Majesty the Queen of England could stand a horse in France and, and, and a horse of his calibre.